report indicates that Al Qaeda is losing core leadership, but affiliate groups are getting more aggressive. Steve Santani is live from Washington. Steve, the president says Al Qaeda is on the run. Is this true? Well, Angel, that's right. He's been saying that a new report by the State Department says terrorism is actually on the rise as aggressive Al Qaeda affiliates pose a serious threat to U.S. interests and U.S. allies. It's not exactly the story President Obama has been telling. Listen. But what I know is, is that thanks to incredible service of our men and women in uniform, Al Qaeda is on the run, and Osama bin Laden is no more. We decimated Al Qaeda's core leadership and brought Osama bin Laden the justice he deserved. Al Qaeda has been decimated. Osama bin Laden is dead. Of course, Osama bin Laden is dead, but the organization he led has now spread out to various trouble spots where its affiliates have evolved and continue to operate. Among other things, the State Department's annual reports on global terrorism found the incidence of terrorism increased 43 percent between 2012 and 2013. There were 9,700 terrorist attacks in 2013, resulting in almost 18,000 deaths. That's up from 6,700 attacks in 2012. Iran is a major sponsor of terrorism. Al-Qaeda is decentralized. Affiliates in Yemen, North Africa, Syria, and Iraq are more aggressive. Terror groups have boosted their presence on social media, but they've had mixed results with their message coming out confusing and contradictory at times. The report also pointed out what it calls a worrisome trend, that is, a significant amount of terrorism in 2013 was sectarian in nature, especially in Syria, Lebanon, and Pakistan. Ainsley? Steve Santani, live in Washington for us this morning. Thank you, Steve. Yeah.